Hi everyone, Trey Gellum here, pastor of First Baptist Church of Ahoski, and it is almost Sunday. We have much going on in the life of our congregation. We are a very active church, one of the things that I love about us. On Tuesday evening, our deacons approved the 2020 proposed budget that was presented by the Finance Committee. So a letter will go out very soon with the proposed budget. We will have a discussion of the proposed 2020 budget this coming Wednesday, October the 23rd, in our fellowship hall. Then we shall vote on the proposed budget Sunday, November the 10th. This Sunday, October the 20th, we will receive deacon nominations. Some time ago, a letter went out with a list of church members who are eligible and willing to serve as deacons. So I am hopeful that you will prayerfully consider the persons who are on that list. From the pulpit this Sunday, I will attempt to provide us with some guidance as we select five new deacons to serve for three years. We shall look together at Jesus' account of the widow's might that is found in Luke chapter 21 verses 1 through 4. Here Jesus observes people putting money into the temple treasury. He notices wealthy people putting money into the temple treasury, and he notices one poor widow woman putting money into the temple treasury. And he says that this poor widow woman put in more money than the wealthy people because she gave sacrificiously. So we will look at this passage this coming Sunday. I am thrilled to be back with you my church family, this Sunday, I look forward to gathering with you for the worship of God on October the 20th. In the meantime, may God's blessings, may God's abundant blessings be upon you and upon your family this weekend.